Hello, welcome back. Welcome back to Excelsior. So, um, I took a look at the, the weapon and armor chart and the only difference between the plate mail and the quick mail is that the plate mail gives you a minus two to dexterity and the quick mail doesn't. So I don't know. Maybe we should just get the. Pl oh no! Let's let's save up for the quick mail. It won't be it won't be much. Also, as I just remembered, we can go to Plibsby. What was it called? Pibsley, and get the marksmanship skill. Okay, so to whom do we have to talk here? Has to be some kind of archer, hasn't it? Okay, and there are a bunch of dudes here. Those are just bards. I've traveled far and wide. You're not very interesting, aren't you? Even though you have traveled far and wide, but you have no stories. They're just sitting around the fire saying, I've traveled far and wide. Oh, that might be. Yes. Fefen, the master, or Fiefen, <laughs> I don't know, the master archer greets you. I can help you develop your skill with bows and crossbows for a nominal fee of a hundred gold pieces. Yes, let's just do this. I don't think we need to, but, uh, yeah. He sets, fed, he sets up a few targets and demonstrates his technique with a beautifully crafted recurve bow. You take some shots and she shows you how to correct your mistakes. By the end of the session, your skill with missile weapons has greatly increased. How fantastic. Uh, what we can also get is the Gauntlet of Might. Yes, we have enough money for that. So, let's wear the Gauntlet of Might. We can sell him our leather gloves. So, how much stuff do we have in our... No, not much. Not much. Uh, we already have Greaves. So, uh, we're not going to get the winged boots. Yes, let's exit this. And, uh, yeah, how about we just continue around this? Oh, no, we have more health points. Ah, that's good. The increased strength actually... Yeah, that actually is good. So, strength also influences your health in this game. Well, that's just gauntlets, but uh, we're gonna pick those up. And that's scale mail, we can sell that for a lot of money. So let's, uh, yeah, let's explore the world. Let's continue exploring the world. How about that? Uh, there's another mountain range over here. Oops. Let's go to this guy. Let's do the autosave. Murder this guy. Chomped staff. We're gonna get that. Hello, can you please hit the goblin? Thank you. And food. Oh good. We have been hey, there's a there's a thing. There's a dungeon. Not while on horseback. Oh yeah, we need to dismount. And then we can enter the dungeon. Dungeon Devenhoven, okay. Locations. Let's just make a note of that. Dungeon Devenhoven west of Stockshire. We don't have any reason to be there just now, so uh, let's not deal with that. And bo bought the horse. That's a that's a weird way to put it, but okay. Attack you. Another charmed stuff. Let's heal up again. All right. So yeah, we will get the quick plate mail um, at some point. What do we have here? Short sword, uh, whatever. Oh, 
A broadsword. Okay, let's just pick that up. Why not? And uh, let's explore the area some more and see what we can find. Oh, it's a lantern. So why about we drop the torch and get the lantern? The lantern might actually just last longer than the torch. Go here. What do we have here? That was just a dude, but... Um, what do we have over here? And a forest. You know, the world can get a little... I don't know. Not confusing, but it's it's big. If you don't stick to the, to the paths. Yeah, let's stick to the paths for now. We can find some more stuff. No problem, I guess. Okay. Just kill the things. Maze or lantern. Need to sell some stuff soon. Oh, there's another town. And what do we have here? This is actually the village of Rualdia. Okay, so maybe we can find Boar. Is this to, to the north, actually? Yeah, maybe it is. The powers of the body are no match for those of the mind. Okay, good. This is an inn. Okay, this is an interesting inn because it's m multiple buildings. Ah, uh, yeah, let's not do that. We don't need that right now. Inspect this. The Well Wisher. Okay. Leave me be. I wish nothing of you, yells the Hermit. Healer greets you. Welcome, my friend. Okay, we can just do the normal healer stuff over here. Okay, you are just a guard. Yes, yes. I stand at the ready day and night. Enjoy your stay and obey the law. Was there anything else in Roldia? No, it wasn't. The wooden horse butchery. Well, this is... I don't know. Get some food. Venison, 11 GP. Pork, 11 GP. Lamb for 10 GP. No, maybe not. Owen the bard uncovers his head from under his hood. It would be an intelligent move to speak to my traveling companion, Mitchell. That wasn't Boer. But... Uh, I think it might be related to this amulet because, yeah, speak to Mitchell. Who is Mitchell? Traveling companion Mitchell. Hmm. Maybe this guy. No, he just stands at the ready. Okay, let's talk to you. Everyone should know how to swim. If you don't, you can learn in Farboro. Okay, skills. Swimming. Farboro. That swimming, okay, and we can delete marksmanship because we already got that. Okay. This door's locked. Actually, don't mind if you just pick their locks. <laughs> These people. I know of a scholar named Shoban Rundledrum who lives in Randaway. He's experimenting with weather control spells. Okay. Mm hmm. Let's make a note of that. Randaway. Shoban, Shoban Rundledrum. Those have, those guys have weird names. Rundledrum. Weather control spells. Okay, oh, got a, getting a bunch of hints here. In there's no door there. Weird. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Leave me be. I wish nothing of you. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I will leave you alone. Sorry that I barged in. You're the only one that had an appropriate reaction. <laughs> Hello there, says the cleric in the, f in the friendly tone of voice. There's a fellow named Jad Merlings who is an expert musician and could be of help to you. Okay, so that's probably the music skill. Uh, music. Jad Merlings. Often hard to find, but he was just here yesterday. Today, who knows? I think he headed off for Bebel. Jet Merlings. Bebel. Okay, well, we got a bunch of hints here. Talk to this guy. This is probably, yeah, we can get a bunch of different spells here. We need to take a look at that again. 
in the in the manual. Yeah, that's the hermit. Who is Mitchell, the traveling companion? I don't know where he might be. Hello, have you seen a guy named Mitchell? What do we have here? Hand bindery. Must tell you my latest theory sometimes, the scholar replies. Okay, well, I'll do that. And you also have your generic thing to say? Welcome to my book bindery. Feel free to browse. So you can't actually do anything here, but it's kind of interesting that the game just puts at this little detail. Or puts in this little detail. Somewhere along the establishment is a master blacksmith who can forge the most delicate items. Okay, there's a master blacksmith. So, where can we find Mitchell? I don't know where Mitchell is. Maybe you are Mitchell. Are you Mitchell? Mitchell the Traveler, yes, is his name. There's a thief in Babel who holds an important key, but you must pay him with some of your own first. Tell him I sent you. Okay, so we... Go to Bebel, pay him with keys. Well, this is a gigantic old scavenger hunt here. <laughs> okay, good. Let's um, keep exploring, man. We can't go down there. There's a mountain range. Let's see if we can find anything in the vicinity other than murdered monsters that we murdered. Murder, murder? No, not really. Okay, how about then we return to the starting town and go from there again in a different direction. Do we have short sword or broad sword? Oh, that's, do we have something that is not worth much. Yeah, we have a short sword. Let's drop that. Let's get the broadsword. Pile of gold. Ah, scouts. You bloody bastards. Let's heal up again. Okay, good. So let's go back. I mean, we could also just go down there and see if we could... Hey, there's a barrel or something. Inspect, you find nothing. Look, a barrel and the shore. It's almost poetic. I don't know what's... what... yeah. But we find nothing in the barrel, so... Uh, hmm. Oh, I tried to talk to the goblin. Yeah, that was probably a bad idea. Not getting gonna get the sh torch and the helm. We don't need that. Um, yeah. Can probably level up several times by now, but uh, that's okay. Okay, so that is, I guess, kind of everything that is up here. So Pibsley, Stockshire, and what was the last one? Rawdia are here in the north. So okay, let's go back down. Uh, let's go. Oh, no, leather armor. I don't know. Also, yeah, we can. Oops. We can actually go to the left here. So maybe this is going to be the next thing that we do. But before that, let's go back to town and uh, sell all the stuff that we have. And maybe we will have enough money then to buy the plate, the quick plate. Or maybe not, we don't have that much, but uh, yeah, maybe we can get the quick plate pretty soon. That would be good. And uh, yeah, then we are going to actually continue exploring. So enter this. Go up. Let's ride in with our horse. Talk to this guy, sell our stuff. It was a thousand and something. Still have anything in our backpack? Yeah, the lantern and the loot, which is the name of my new book that I'm writing. The lantern and the loot would actually be a good name, I would, I would say. Okay, um, how about we just spend the rest of this episode murdering dudes? 
and selling stuff. I think I'm just gonna do this. Because, uh, yeah, then we can just get the quick plate and be done with it. Also, yeah, I'm, I'm just not gonna get, uh, just not gonna level up for the time being. We're gonna level up in due time when we need it for dungeons or something, but right now we are actually fine. Fine right now. And uh, the, the experience that we get, even though we can't see it here, is actually cumulative. So um, the experience we earn right now also works for the next level. So uh, we're just leveling up like... Oh, our backpack is already full. Let's enter, sell stuff, and continue. Rinse and repeat. Grinding. You know, this is an RPG. There's some grinding to be involved here. That's okay. Talk to this guy. Sell all of our nonsense. Yeah, maybe just one more round of grinding and then we are... Then we are actually fine to buy the buy the buy the good stuff. Buy the battle axe, spatum. Yeah, let's get leather gloves and lantern. Can sell the lantern at the provisioner, I guess. Helm and large shield. I think large shields actually give you a bunch of money. More enemies, please spawn. Would you like to? Hello, enemies. Hey. Oh, there's a ogre or troll. It's a troll. Only 15 gold pieces, but that's also good. Hello. Spawny, spawny. Oh, there's a... There's a dude in the castle, or in front of the castle. A troll. Let's get the longsword, let's get the wooden shield. Kill the scout. We don't like scouts. Backpack is already full. Oh, yeah. Just how it goes. Let's go up here. Go to the provisioner. Sell our stuff. Use one of the lanterns to the provisioner. And sell the rest to these guys. Yeah, we actually might have enough now. Yes. So, yeah, let's go and get the quick plate, and then, uh, let, then let's continue exploring, I would say. We need to find a few towns. This open-endedness, and that pretty much that the whole world map is accessible, is also kind of an Ultima thing, I think. So, yeah, this game is very much inspired by Ultima. Ultima is a little more obtuse and weird. This is kind of... The game also strikes me as kind of easy. Uh, I think it was here, wasn't it? Yes, I think it was. Oh, let's kill you too. Why not? Okay. Let's see. Let's... Go up here, and there you are. Buy quick plate. Yes, we can get the quick plate, and uh, let's wear the quick plate. Okay, and now we can probably sell the bandit mail, and now we have a bunch of money again. Okay, let's get some food. Is that an inn or a food? No, that's a an inn or a food here. Sure. No, that was something else. But I think we can get some food in here, can't we? Yes, gruel, accept 99, gruel, accept 99, gruel, accept 99, gruel, accept 99, gruel, accept 99. Oh no, we can't, we don't have enough money anymore. But now we have enough food, we have so much gruel, we are going to vomit gruel everywhere, I guess. Alright, good. Like this, wood shade. Okay, so we can get to wood shade. Was there something in wood shade? I don't think we have heard of wood shade before. So, yeah, let's save the game. LP4. And uh, in the next episode, we are going to go down there. We're probably going to find wood shade and find a few, uh, few other stuff. 
find a few other things. That would be good. And uh, let's continue for the amulet. Oh, let's pick up all this stuff. Uh, good, pick up everything. Murder everything. <laughs> Sorry, that was creepy. Alright, bye-bye.